let's go ahead and start a new game. <clears throat> yeah, I'm excited to play this game. Alright. Alright, strap in everyone. Please get your coffee or water, whatever you'd like to drink. Get a blanket. Because <laughs> we're getting, we're chilling and getting cozy. Mine is somewhere in the last few months before my 13th birthday. Whatever happened before. What's his voice acting? Forever gone. This looks so cool. I don't remember anything. Okay. Chapter one. Oh, there's chapters. Okay. The house. This dream again. Mimi. <laughs> no, we're Mimi. This dream, again. My head hurts, and so does my back. Where's my phone? Must be dad. Alright, open the bag. Oh, that's so cool. Okay, our phone. Alright, new message, read. Uh, this is from Fab Price? <laughs> Where are you? Your mother is worried sick. Of course it's dad. Okay, so this is our dad. As if you weren't. Okay, where are you? Your mother is worried sick. Alright. Um. I should answer. Okay, almost at the house. <laughs> That game design looks so, so cool. I know! It looks so cool! Quickly, for once, let's see what he has to say. What are you hoping to achieve? You know what I want. I want to clear the, the house out. Nora left me a box. Memories. I need to find out more. Okay. I don't need to do this. I need to find answers. I don't want to fight with you. Uh, I need to find answers. You don't. Come home. Oh, wow. Okay. He'll never understand. He hates. Hated Nora. Doesn't matter. The removals people are coming on Friday to get rid of all the junk. Do what you want, but you can't. Hmm. This isn't going to be easy. Come on, Mimi. You can do it. I should stop answering for now, or else he'll keep sending messages until I come home. In the same week, I lost my job, and my grandmother, Nora, died, and I got my hands on two letters. Okay. This is so cool! Her sitting in the backgrounds? Okay. Oh, wow, okay. Dear Fabrice, I'm writing to you to let you know that, in accordance with your mother's will, in your recent phone call, the door... Dordogne house will be emptied next week. I would like to express how deeply sorry I am for your loss. Nora was a friend of mine, and I hope you don't mind me saying that, but despite your differences, I know you cared as much for her as she cared for you. Please let my office know if you change your mind regarding the sale of the house. Given the current state of the market, I have no doubt you'll find a buyer before December, but a property like this should stay in the family. You will find in this envelope a few words addressed to your daughter. Thank you for giving it to her directly. With my most sincere condolences. Simone? Okay. It's from France. Oh. Alright. Yeah, I stole this letter from Dad. He was never going to tell me about Nora, about my own grandmother. But the other message, that was the biggest surprise. Wait, 
wait, so he wasn't gonna tell us about, like, our grandmother? Gosh, parking beside, like, two big trucks Dear gives me so much anxiety. This letter will come as a surprise to you. Your father decided to cut ties with me. 20 years ago. A oh, choice okay. I understood, but never accepted. This letter is about goodbyes. I will be gone by the time you read it. Oh. I've left something for you in my house. A box of memories and a letter. <laughs> this is so pretty. I hope you like to play and explore as much as you did the last time you visited Dordania. Dordania. Okay, that's how you say it. Forever with you, Nora. A little kitty. <sighs> I'm sorry if you can hear the background noise. There's someone cutting their grass. <laughs> so I, I apologize for that. <laughs> this game is entertaining as hell. I know. All right, I don't remember this place. I've been here before, but I don't remember anything. I wonder if, would they hide the key somewhere? Okay, now we get to move around and stuff. Especially the fact you, <laughs> you playing it makes it even better. Oh, uh, I'm glad to be playing it. I love like sharing like these little cozy games with y'all. All right, so we move here. So let's interact. The house is really cute. Okay. I can see something in the letterbox. Oh, a key. Someone must have dropped it in there. Okay. Grab the key. Let's empty that letterbox. Ads. That's a really good deal if you need a power saw. Someone's lost their cat. Oh no! Alright, this was dated October 1st, 2002. To Nora's family, I just heard about Nora's passing and I want to share with you my deepest sadness. The whole town shares your pain and we hope you will find peace in knowing how much good Nora did since she moved to the region in the 50s. Our most sincere condolences. Alright. Okay, so she must have been, like, a really good person if, um, if someone, or if, like, the mayor and stuff sent that letter. Can't get my fingers through the opening. But the letter box is loose. I think I can lift it and shake it. Okay. Um, shake the letter box. Damn, the key is stuck at the bottom of the letterbox. Let's see if I can take the back off the letterbox. Okay. <laughs> oh wait, take the back off the letterbox, okay. Uh. Okay, there we go. Okay, that's cool, just have a, a random screwdriver <laughs> okay <laughs> thankfully I had a screwdriver in the car okay. I was about to say just carrying around a screwdriver 
Got it. Let's grab the key. Okay. Alright, got the key. Okay. Now I'll be able to open the door. Alright, cool. Now to the house. Okay, so we can also check our phone and everything. Alright, here's like the little quest list and everything. Also, let me... Let me move my camera real quick. <laughs> there we go. Alright, let's go to the house. Wait, can we actually, like, explore over here, though? <gasps> we can. Locked. Good, because I wasn't going to start investigating a damp cave. Okay. I... I think I remember this. This place feels abandoned. Alright, let's go inside the house. <laughs> So we gotta go down this way. Okay, yeah. Wow, I'm shaking. Okay. It fits. I do like you actually have to like turn things so it's it's like you're actually opening the door. <laughs> I don't remember anything about this place, yet this house feels like home. Too bad I can't see a thing. Alright, find some light to look around the house. Um, I'm not going anywhere without a light. Okay. Oh, here's a candle. Here you are. Open the matchbox. Okay. <sighs> Key check. Light check. Next goal. Huh. The door. The box. Nora left for me. Stop talking to yourself, Mimi. <laughs> okay. Um. Wait. This pen. Move the cap. I don't know why, but I feel like this game is going to make me cry. Or at least just like, kind of feel emotional. Ooh. Move the paper. Do you remember this pen? I knew you would find it right away. Yours truly, Nora. Wait, I... I remember. <gasps> it's a memory! Going back in time. Make sure she brushes her teeth. She's always trying to get out of doing it. Fabrice, I know how to bring up a child. Fabrice. I'm glad she's here with me. We'll have fun, the two of us. That was before we moved to the States. 1982, I think. We have to go now. Mimi? Mimi! Yes? Say goodbye. <laughs> so, our dad sounds so mean. This game is going to be an emotional roller coaster for sure. I can sense it. Yeah, that's what I feel like too. Okay. Come on, let's get your suitcase to your room. 
Whatever. Okay. Unpack the suitcase in the ups bedroom upstairs. Okay. Oh, look at this. I have like a little garden. I hope I won't have to eat these. It feels empty without grandpa. Got to unpack first or they'll tell me off. Okay. <laughs> it's like I always want to explore. Wait, what is this? You collected a new sticker. Oh, okay. Oh, that's so cool. We get to collect stickers. There was something here, too. Snail sticker. Okay. Any more stickers? It's <gasps> over here. The gate's open. Grandma used to lock it before. Grandma was afraid I would drown. <laughs> I know how to swim. Okay, let's go unpack first. <laughs> I don't want to keep getting sidetracked. <laughs> This is going to be a long summer. Okay. Oh. Another sticker. Alright. Let's go upstairs. This is so cute! <laughs> Okay, this is our grandmother's room. All right, all right, all right. Is this our room? Oh. It was super duper fun to watch you talk and play. Oh, I'm glad. I'm glad that you had fun. Okay, this is like the bathroom. Let's see. It's locked. Uh, how am I supposed to get into the room then? <laughs> Take lots of care of, um, of yourself. Of course. I hope you have a good um, rest of your day as well, Melon. I appreciate you being here. And hopefully I'll see you next time. Ugh, why do I have to do it now? Okay. Let's open it up. So many sweaters. It's summer, mom. <laughs> She's so annoying. Dad. Dad really wants me to brush my teeth. He, he was very weird in the car. Okay. Oh. We unpacked that. Next drawer. Uh, hope. I hope the summer will pass quickly. Okay. Moving away. I wish I could spend it with my friends instead of coming here. Right? What's that? Mom must have popped this in my suitcase. Oh, it's a map. Okay, cool. A map? That'll be useful if I can get out of the house. <laughs> okay. So there's like different places that we can go. Okay. I better go downstairs. Uh, reach grandma in the kitchen. Uh, the kitchen is probably this way. Yep. I'm sorry if I keep gushing about the art style, but it's just so, it's so beautiful. Alright. All done? Yep. 
Can I go and play outside? It's dinner time soon. Ah. Why don't you draw something? There's paper in the living room. Okay. Your dad told me you had some homework to do over the summer for your new school. Huh? <laughs> The sticker's so cute. <laughs> okay. Um, I need to find the paper. What is this? Yay! I collected the binder. Okay. I couldn't find any papers, so let's use this old thing. Draw? I'm not even seven anymore. Hmm. <laughs> what should I draw? Oh, I was like, are they expecting me to draw something? <laughs> so I was like, I am not the best drawer. Parents, always a safe choice. Uh, okay. There we go. Have you finished? Yes, I have. This isn't for drawing. It. it looks old and... Of course it's old. I've had it since before your dad was born. I, it's just that... Oop. I... <laughs> Wait, did we make her cry? <laughs> I, I'm sorry, Mimi. Uh, listen, silence. Uh, sorry. Sorry, I thought... No, no, it's fine, sweetie. You've never shown me that binder before. Is it a secret? I usually lock it up in the attic. Oh. Um, hidden. Okay, so you get like different choices and stuff. I want to learn the binder. What is it exactly? It's a binder, an old thing I've had for decades. This binder is very important to me. Your gran grandfather and I, we used it to write to each other through these pages. So, it's precious? Yes, but maybe, you know what? Why don't you take it? Take it. Why? Because it wasn't meant to end. We used the binder so it would never be over. We could always add pages. Do you understand? I think so. It's like a never-ending book. Promise me you'll keep writing and drawing in it. That it'll keep it alive. Would you like me to show you how to use it? Yeah. Alright. First you can write everything you need to remember. Um, to do here. Let's add the map your mother gave you. This way you can't get lost. Alright. Okay, so this is where we can see what all stickers we collected. We always kept the binder organized, so I'm hoping you'll do the same with the tabs. All the little memories you've collected are tidied and stored in here. Maybe we'll put some new stuff in this binder over the holiday. I'll let you explore it by yourself. Alright, uh... Gallery... So this is where our stickers are. This is the chapters. Okay. Okay, so it stores like the, um... Like the choices that you make. I wonder if you can like go back and pick like a different choice? And see if you get like a different outcome of it. Okay, there's two stickers that I'm missing. Alright. 
I think that was the first memory. Okay, chapter two, the river. All right. I wonder how many chapters there are. Because <laughs> it seems like that chapter was really fast. The binder. I remember it now. Maybe the binder is in the box. The candle won't last forever. Let's open the shutters. Okay. Ooh. Let's go over here. Light. Ah, feels good. more? Let's see. Probably have to go in the kitchen. Oh, yep. Open these up. Much better. This place hasn't changed. natural light in the house okay um probably have to go can i go this way no let's go upstairs i haven't been here in 20 years grandma left me a box it should be in my room right i can't see a thing let's open the shutters good. Uh, I can't go in this room. So let's go into my old room. Okay, the things were already open in here. Go in here. Uh, was that all of the? Okay. Guess I gotta look for the box. <laughs> oh, there's a key. Can I get it or no? Let's see what's in here. Okay, there it is. Ooh, okay, there's a couple of things. This tape. This is ancient. Where am I gonna find a tape player in <laughs> 2002? Letters. I better save them. I don't want to... I don't want the removal people... Um, to throw them away. Let's see. A letter Nora wrote to Edward. Oh, Grandpa. My dear Edward, this trip to Paris is wearing me out and I miss our house terribly. Yesterday for lunch, I saw some colleagues from the agency. Uh, Michelle says hi. I met some of the new architects, including a couple of very bright interns. The stench of cigarettes and cold coffee, the crumpled paper sheets, the tables covered in drawings. What a joy to find again. These half-forgotten memories. I immediately felt a strange um, lassitude Ooh, excuse me. and went back to the hotel. I had to be rested to meet Helena, uh, Fabrice's new girlfriend. Dinner was in a small bistro in Porte Maillot. Oysters because I absolutely love them. Helena comes from a very wealthy family, but she is quite nice, if a little uptight. 
you know me, I couldn't stop teasing her about that. And Fabrice and I started one of our little arguments. If you had been there, uh, you would have found the right words to calm him down. I couldn't, so I lost my temper. Time for me to leave. It's quite late and I would like to sleep before the next leg of my trip. Tomorrow is... Nan Nantis? After tomorrow is... Uh... Hui Baron? I will be back as planned next week by the 4pm train. Until then, I drop a kiss on your lips. You're Nora. Mom and Nora meeting. That was intense. Hmm. Late 1970. She was already pregnant with me. Okay, so our mom's name is Helena. This was in Paris, 1970. Okay. Okay, enough of that. Let's get back to the drawer. What? An old camera. My old camera. Rotate. Unfold the flash. Oh, this is so cool! Okay. It's here. And then... So. Alright, so we got a camera. It works after all of these. Another memory. I hope you guys have been enjoying um, this game so far. <laughs> it's almost nine. <laughs> Me when I wake up early in the morning. the first few days far from home okay get ready for the day breakfast is ready right time to go down I kind of like feel her how she's like how she was saying um getting that vibe where she didn't really want to like stay with her grandma especially if like you know you're like a kid because I do remember like times when I would like visit my grandma and it was like nice like I always cherish it but it's like you know you feel homesick for like the first like couple of days or so So I definitely understand, like, how she's feeling like, she, you know, she would rather be hanging out with friends and stuff. All right. A new tape. Okay. Lost sounds. Oh, you can play them. Imagine how miserable we'll be without these. These what? These sounds. Listen to this engine. How it purrs. Edward, get your head out of that exhaustion pipe or it will fill your empty skull. Oh my god. What are you doing? Recording this engine's rumble. Recording a truck engine. <laughs> In the middle of the most gorgeous poppy field you've ever seen. <laughs> these engines are disappearing, Nora. I've got to save them for the next generations. <laughs> Do you actually believe our grandkids will have less engine noises? Of course. In 20 years, maybe even sooner, cars will be silent. And they'll <laughs> fly, right? Well, why not? We were born before fridges, freezers, and washing machines. Uh, I'll be by the picnic table. One day, she'll see how wrong she was. <laughs> okay. Why do 
don't you sit down? Breakfast is the most important meal of the day. Alright, let's eat some breakfast. Do you want a drink? What do you usually have at home? Uh, bitter, sad. Uh, let's get some juice. Ow, the juice hurts my teeth. It's from a farm near here. Real apple juice. <laughs> Hungry? I made some toast. Okay, uh... Now, I don't know about y'all, but I love putting... Jelly on my toast. <laughs> it's very bitter. I don't like it. It's good, but it's not very sweet. I add very little sugar, and the strawberries are from the garden. Can I have some cereal? I bought the cereal for you, but it isn't good. Dreadful ingredients. But I like it. Your mother insisted. It's full of sugar. Mimi, really. You can have a little bit, no more. Okay. Habits. Take some cereal. Oh gosh. Oh my god, completely missing the bowl. Okay. Y'all think that's enough cereal? <laughs> okay. Am I am I done or more cereal? Yeah, let me just like overflow the bowl with cereal. Oh gosh. Okay. Can I put that down? <laughs> Come on, I told you the cereal is really bad for you. Are you all right? Mimi? Um, not hungry. I'm okay. Uh, I'm okay. You know that in here, it is okay to not be okay. Oh gosh, yeah. This is, this is definitely gonna get me emotional. <laughs> Hate here, friends, home. Um... I don't want to say I hate it here. Um, friends are home. Uh, I'll do home. I want to go home. You can't. You're here with me, and your parents are getting ready to move to the U.S. It's it's unfair. I know you miss your parents. Hmm. And your friends. Yes. Let's go out. Let's do something, just the two of us. What do you think? I would like that. She would usually have snapped or shouted, but she simply, she gave me something. I could tell she was forcing herself to be nice. Go to the river with grandma. Okay. Now we get to do a little bit of exploring. I remember now, we would be walking down to the river. She'd be quiet, lost in her thoughts. My father hated it when I did that. He probably hated his mother too when she was like that. The river, the pebbles, the cold, cold water, the dull dining. Yay! You unlocked a new location, Riverbanks. Okay, cool. Oh, it's pretty. The view is gorgeous from the middle of the river, but here, take this. Yay! Ah, okay. It's where we get the camera. Oh, a camera. It was your grandfather's and now it's yours. Really? Look around you. The view is just spectacular. 
I'll get a picture from the middle of the river. Okay. It's so pretty. Oh my gosh, this is... This is so pretty, y'all. Look at this. I, I, I can't get over how beautiful this game is. Alright, Mimi. First, you have to focus on your subject. Um, okay. I don't know what to focus on. Let's see. Try to get a little bit of everything so we can get like the balloons and stuff. Only then can you take your picture and voila. Okay. Uh. Oh, I wanted to get like the. Okay, I guess that's the best we can do to get a hot air balloon. <laughs> okay. Look, we've got company. Why don't you take a photo of these hot air balloons up there? Oh! <gasps> oh my gosh! Y'all, I, I can't. This is so pretty! <laughs> With like the sun beaming down, I can't. Okay, let's um... This looks like a good spot. Let's do this one. There you go. Good. One last picture before we head out. Okay. Um, let's take a picture of this. Right here. Oh, that, that's gorgeous. Fantastic. And don't forget, you only have a limited number of photos. Okay. Okay, we gotta take 10. Let's take a picture of Grandma here. so cute I love this um I wish there was a frog right here we'll take a picture of this there we go all right five's enough <laughs> we'll have five photos your holidays got off to a bit of a rough start but I do hope you're feeling better, sweetie. I, yes, I think. Today was... Um... Pretty good or fun? I'll say fun. I'm glad, sweetie. What kind of pictures are you going to take with your with the camera? Um... You, river, or nature? You, river, nature, uh... I'll say you. Pictures of you. Oh, thank you. But look around you. It's much more beautiful. I'll tell you what. Why don't we note all your ideas down in the binder? The handy dandy binder. Poetry, decorate, sticker. Let's decorate. I know exactly how I want to decorate my page. Sounds exciting. What do you say we put more headings in your binder so you can create some great pages? Craft your own page. There you go. Here you can create your own page with all the memories you get. When you're happy with your page, you can move it here and it will become parts of the binder. How about creating your first page? I'll leave you to it. Okay. Get... Let's 
get the photo of grandma here. Right here. Oh, so it's like a little scrapbook. That's cute. Yes. We'll do it where it's like. Uh, we can do... I must admit, it's fun. Uh, momentary joy amused by smiles. Um... Create a poem. No. You, Nora, carried away by your gaze. Oh, this is so cute! You need two more words to complete the poem. Okay, um... No landmark, no compass. Let's do that one. And... Let's see. Momentary joy, we'll do that one. Carried away by your gaze, Nora. No landmark, no compass, momentary joy. I feel like this poem doesn't make any sense. But we're gonna we're gonna keep it anyway. <laughs> there we go. Oh, I love how you can do like little scrapbook. The spinder was a connection between your grandfather and me. I think he would love seeing you use it. I I miss him. Oh, I do too, my dear. I do too. Aww. This game is so precious. I, like... I love the memories so much. Letters from the past. Poems. Pictures. Postcards. Huh? What's that? <gasps> a cat? Oh, it's so cute! <laughs> oh, it must be Nora's cat. She looks hungry. I think the cat also has a key. What's that noise? I'd better check. You stay still, little one. <laughs> Hello, Missy. <laughs> Whoa, no, 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 no. <gasps> I wasn't very brave there. I must be hungry, and I need that key. That cat said, Do not touch me. I don't know you. Chapter 3, The Market. 